Hey, what's up? My name is Nick Wichman, and I just wanted to share three tips, three ways how to remove audio from video files for free. Some of my friends have been asking me this. They are putting videos onto websites, video backdrops, sometimes ambient video for retail screens, and if the audio is built in, baked into the track, that can cause problems because you don't want it playing in the background. We're gonna go through iMovie, VLC, and right in YouTube. And so if you're posting to Squarespace, YouTube links work, and you just need to take the audio away. First, let's get onto the screen. I'm gonna do it like that right here. And we're in iMovie. So in iMovie, make a new, new file, new movie. In Finder, grab your video. Here's a video of me recording the throwing of a TV from a 20, 20 foot window, which you can go check out in another video. I'll link you here, wait, bing. You can see the video, we can listen to it. There's some audio on there. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna right click on this video clip, detach audio. Here's the audio file in green, right click that, right click that, delete. Boom, it's done, it's gone. Now we just need to save it. File, up in the it's off screen, but file, share to a file. This is the easy way to do it, to put it onto your computer before sending it out. That way you can post it to other places. You can tag it if you want. The video and audio is what you'll select because the audio is now gone, it doesn't matter. The resolution will be, you wanna choose the highest you can. This is a 720p clip, that's okay. Quality best you can do that if you want um, or high or whatever compress faster or better quality and that's it hit next you'll save it to a place boom audio gone iMovie down that's only for OS X Mac users I get that so PC users it's your turn next we're gonna go to VLC we've got the video open we're gonna do file, convert, stream. Couldn't see it, it's off the screen. File, convert, stream. And then we have the file right here. We'll do customize the profile. We're gonna to go to the video codec. We're gonna keep the video, the original settings as the track we're looking at, or the clip we're looking at. Audio codec. We're just gonna turn the audio off. It's that easy. Encapsulation, you'll wanna do it. You get to choose here. MP4 and MOV is great. We'll apply. Down here, we'll hit save as file. Bada bing, bada boom. Save it wherever you want. It'll take a second to, to render that. And VLC, by the way, is a, VLC is a free software online. It is one of the best uh, video players that you can use. It handles colors a lot more accurately than QuickTime. You might notice this if you are making videos and seeing a lot of color changes from Premiere or iMovie to QuickTime. Just so you know, get VLC. Search that, VLC. I'll put a link down below. Next, VLC's done. Thank you, VLC. Bye-bye. YouTube, go to your videos. Upload your video with sound. Go to it, we'll do, go to the um, video manager, edit audio. This is pretty simple. It's kind of unclear on you on YouTube side that this does this, but so cool. Oh no, this video has copyrighted information. What I'll do is I'll take the volume slider all the way down and save. Says, while well, I edit to process, users will continue to see the current version of the video. That's okay, you're getting rid of it. We're hitting save, it's gonna process it, and then the audio will be gone. It's that easy, it's so easy. Um, and that's it, we got iMovie. Just detach the clip, erase it, re-export it. We got VLC, do the streaming and exporting uh, wizard. And then you just turn off the audio and YouTube, edit your video,
go under edit, audio, just pull the slider down and mute it and then hit save. That's, that's it. I hope this helped some of you. Um, if you're doing websites and using video and and trying to get uh, audio lists uh, clips, then, then use these and let me know if they help. And if you need anything else, let me know. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Subscribe if you want to see more and uh, uh, good luck.